Turkey this week became the second country visited by President Hassan Sheikh Mohamud since he became president. Ankara just might be Somalia's most important development partner moving forward. Turkey has been active, especially in Mogadishu, since 2011 when Recep Erdogan first visited. Turkish Development Agency coordinator Ilhamis Touris supplies a long list of projects. We have built roads, installed road solar lights in Mogadishu, sent students to be educated in Turkey, built a state-of-the-art training and research hospital, Somalia Civil Aviation Center, egg poultry farming, installed greenhouses and laboratories at different universities, and built the Somali Parliament Building in Mogadishu. Ankara's investments appeared to taper off a bit in the last year and a half, as the Formaggio administration clung to power amid a controversial election delay. The new president should have reassured Turkey's leadership in his visit this week. There is much to be done to help modernize Somalia and meet key challenges. While thousands of Somali troops have been trained in Turkey, and a training center was built by the Turks in Somalia, Turkey's drones are rated among the most effective worldwide. They have been used in Libya and are said to have caused that conflict to end with negotiations leading to elections. Deployed against al-Shabaab, they could also bring talks to fruition. Here again, the Turks could be helpful as mediators. The government has an Islamist pedigree, and they have seen success at the bargaining table in Libya. Among the tenets of their energy policy are to ensure the diversification of routes and resources in the supply of oil and natural gas, taking into account the increasing demand and import dependency, to contribute to regional and global energy security, to be a regional trade center in energy. The country's appetite for electricity is growing faster than any nation on earth except China. They could provide funding for exploration and would be interested in creating infrastructure that allows oil and gas to reach them from the Sea of Aden. Turkey sponsors hundreds of Somali students to come study there. They have built a sports field at Somalia National University in Mogadishu. Ankara also funded an agricultural school that hosts 400 Somali students. An international university campus would be a welcome addition in Somalia perhaps a branch of the country's top-rated Chankaya University or Istanbul Technical University, providing much-needed innovation skills. Even Middle East Technical University, which gets a high ranking from U.S. News and World Report. This could have a lasting impact on Somalia and create a bond with its youth that would keep Turkey popular for decades to come. ADN TV will continue to report on diplomatic developments across Africa.